this is the energy vibration laser for <laughs> the um, Sagittarian Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. Ooh. I want to say good morning. Good morning, my darlings. Okay, for you, Sagis, it is um, the month of January and the year 2019 I want to say thank you for all your support likes and share if this is the first time you're on my channel please subscribe subscribe please share these videos Sagis. okay share these videos um, so please like and share these videos listen to your Sun Moon Horizon sign go back and listen to the year video it is good the third quarter because um, sometimes there's information in these videos now this video is going to take at least 45 minutes and so um, the um, first couple of minutes will be on YouTube the rest is going to be on, on demand I want to say thank you for the support of 2018 and please like and share these videos okay and I know you guys miss me on live I'm gonna surprise you if you want to have because I've changed things up if you want to have a live chat with me a super chat um, we are going to start doing super chat on YouTube okay so um, I'm gonna be back doing the lives okay because I really um, miss the lives I miss you guys too and there is some Sagittarians that just saying you know we miss you so let's see what is coming in the month of January the year is a water year and the month of January is also water energies okay and let's see what's coming up for you Sagittarians you have the energy of the hurt energy that is also the energy in the first week so um, it is about balance so we're going to be looking for the Sagittarians what is coming up for the Sagittarian in the month of January okay there is going to be some success coming in the first week for you Sagittarians this is the energy of you achieve some achievement and success is coming in for some of you this is going to be you or planning um, for the year because you're trying to bring stability and balance in your world um, you're trying to be making things happen this year so you are in the stage of making something some of you could be also trying to think about ways of starting your business or making extra money so this is good this is a positive energy when it comes out okay so what else is here for the Sagittarians um, Sagittarian Sun Moon Horizon for the second week the deck I'm using is the mystic Monday the mystic Monday okay there is a new start there's a new offer there's a new job offer that is going to be coming in for you Sagittarius this is good this is wonderful it could be a management position um, take it it's going to be wonderful so um, some of you could be receiving message in the second week of, of a, a new job coming in with a management position and this is going to be good for some of you it could be message about your financial stability is going to be better or you're trying to build something your business whatever it is it's going to be very positive energy of the tower is here in the third week so whatever is transpiring the third week is a change of, of the energies because you were dealing with earth energies and now you're moving into the air energy so whatever was blocking or stuntering your growth this has now ended the end of the situation and the new beginning is going to be happening in the fourth week and this is going to be wonderful it's going to be very wonderful very positive because you're going to be seeing that things are taken out um, a better th things whatever needs to end um, is ending and something new is about to come in now wonderful energies the six of ones this is good this is really positive this is good good news is about to come in so Sagis, your month is just not looking that bad okay Sagis. so um, you begin with a fire energy um, it's all about fire and earth Sagis. oh my god and this is it Sagis. okay all right we have the king of Pentacles okay so someone who is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn this is a very wealthy businessman 
um, is going to be offering you something okay this is a very wealthy businessman who is going to be coming in and offering you Sagittarius and a promotion a job um, this could be a leadership role okay so um, this is good okay before I go any further Sagittarius, because I need to tell you guys this the year 2019 for you Sagittarius, which you are vibrating because you're vibrating in the year 2019 but you have just begun the year 2018 so for you guys it is year 2018 um, but the linear air is 2019 now because of the linear air you're going to be very lucky in this year you said go back and listen to your air year reading and go back and listen and order you know order your personal reading because the Sagis that have done readings for the year reading for is very very lucky very lucky people okay and this is good very lucky people okay so the energy of the Empress is here some of you said and it's a good month the month of January because whatever that was blocking you because you have um, the Emperor in the first week second week you're um, the ace of ones and the ace of ones is always um, a message coming in about work or something that has to do with work or something that has to do with your passion it could be an offer of a business it could be an offer of a working together but in the third week whatever that was stunting your growth um, before your birthday your last birthday it's going to come to an end and it's definitely going to come to an end because a new beginning is here and this new beginning whatever because remember the world is ending something and a new start and you also have uh, the energy of the six of one so this is good so what is happening here and what is transpiring here is basically you have a really good month Sagis. whatever is happening you Sagis, you have a really really good month because you have fire 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 for the three first month a hurt which is the world which is the situation is ended and a new beginning the, the energy of the six of ones is here so that is good so going back um, and moving forward the energy of the ace of ones and the tower what is that about the energy of the ace of ones and the tower what is that about to said is it's about the Queen of Pentacles it's about the Queen of Pentacles so oh my god you Sagis a lot of you Sagittarians are going to be working with um, a lot of you Sagittarians are going to be working with the Taurus Taurus Virgo and Capricorn people because you said and the Taurus uh, and the Capricorns it's a positive year for you guys so it's, it's, it's if you both are going to be aligning this is going to be good this is going to be positive so Sagittarians this is a good year for you guys okay um, the king and queen of Pentacles is coming in so they are the Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn okay some of you are going to be really connecting with these earth sign people because things are going to be happening okay you guys could be making things happen you guys could be blowing shit out the water you guys could be changing things how things are happening okay let's see what is happening okay um there is going to be um positive positive endeavor if you decide to go in business with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn this is going to be so good this is going to be extremely good so whatever the situation is and whatever is transpiring um, this is going to be good because what you guys are going to be doing you guys are going to be vibrating on such a powerful high speed that is happening that it is just going to be so good King of Pentacles Queen of Pentacles and the financial stability they are going to be making money for work for you now I told you magic it's as if you Sagittarius are going to be connecting with the earth sign people and especially if it's a Capricorn you are going you people are going to make magic because what I'm seeing here is that the hurt something is ending the earth sign is always the Capricorns some good news is coming in you working together with a Capricorn it's going to be a huge huge success this year 
Um, what I should go back and say to you, Sagittarius, is that if your parents is Earth signs um, there, and you have been having um, some disruptions, there is going to be a new start between you and your parents. Okay, so if there was some misunderstanding and that sort of a thing, a new connection is going to be coming in. So let's see what else is coming up for the Sagittarius, King of Pentacles and the Queen of Pentacles. What is this all about? Um, it has to do with the King of Sword. Okay, so the King of Swords um, and a new start. King. So, and some of you Sagittarian, if you have a brother that is um, an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra, and there was some family discomfort where there was, um, you know, yeah, it can be um, disruption in the family. It's going to be resolved. Okay. Let's see the Queen of Pentacles, the Four of Pentacles. Um, there is going to be balance. You have to find balance. There is going to be balance in the situation. Whatever the situation is, you're going to be balancing this out. This is going to be good. The energy of the Tower is here. So what is transpiring is that with the energy of the Tower, you're going to be seeing um, that you're uh, after what needs to leave your life then you're going to be balancing out your financial stability is going to be balancing out it could be that you Sagittarius are also helping the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn to do this now there is a decision that whatever it is that needed to end it is going to be ended and then a new start is going to be coming in and this new start is just going to be wonderful because what is going to be happening is that it's, it's as if you need to end something and then open up new doors and possibility and this is going to be good king of swords and the balance what is this for the Sagittarians wheel of fortune this is a karmatic situation some of you Sagittarians could be connecting um, with uh, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn there is some um, situation especially for you men you businessmen um, you are reconnecting with people of the past now I'm seeing the energy of the Emperor whoever this energy of the Emperor is um, it could be a master that comes in and is going to be helping out you Sagittarian now this master could be a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn but yet still you guys are dealing with an Aquarius Gemini or Libra now you men are all connected from the past you guys could be going into business whatever this is you guys could be really really going into business and it's going to be a success okay let's see what is coming out with balancing and the six of swords number six is going to be oh la la okay alrighty um okay you sagis you're bringing it down bringing it down Okay, Sagittarius. Um, okay, so something has ended. You Sagittarians who were dealing with an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra, you bring balance to a situation. The Tower bring uh, move away a deceptive situation that you were dealing with with an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. Now you could have connected with this man um, because it's 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 um, it's, it's if. Um, and a, a, a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person came in your life and what has happened and what is transpiring is that um, you have in connection with this person who is an Aquarius Gemini or Libra this is someone 45 years and older and whatever that was happening to this lady or this person you bring the tower down you end the situation because it's as if an Aquarius Gemini or Libra person was trying to block this person and you know trying to keep trying to met and, and it can be that you it's some of you it was a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn it can be that it was a um, uh, a couple that you're helping because they're here together King and Queen of Pentacles they're both beside each other they want to give you something and they want to they're representing something to you but there was someone who was an Aquarius Gemini or Libra that was there and this person was affecting them from a past lifetime and you bring the tower down in the third week and you're like no more leave them alone or leave her alone or leave him alone and you're releasing something 
that was blocking this this couple or this person because it can be a couple it can be a man or a woman but you bring down that thing okay so that's good so let's see what is going to be the outcomes of this for you guys what is going to be the outcomes for the Sagittarius in the month of January outcomes Wow seven of Pentacles you are about to um, you are about to really 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 begin something new a new project a new endeavor with um, someone who you're connecting with this person is from the past life the two of cups this person is from the past life and you know take the extended reading there's so much more information is here for you guys I gotta go all right let's see the cards before I end this um, session we're working with the um, series star seed and the five of orbs is here the five of orbs is conflict so obviously yes you're having conflicts with an Aquarius Gemini or Libra person um, and this conflicts is happening in the spirit realm okay because um, if you see this person it's not of this earth form it is happening in the spirit world so whoever is out there that is working um, in the spirit world you are working on a positive energy and you're bringing this down and this is what I say to people if there is a situation that you are unable to resolve in uh, the awakened world you can always resolve it in um, the sleeping time okay so a lot of people are doing that now let's see what is going to be transpiring for you Sagis. I have two animal spirit energies for you Sagis. let's see what is going to be happening first one if you choose the first one and this is the second one the first one is the ego spirit spirit has your back this card has been coming up for a lot of people spirit have your back okay this is number 23 23 is five spirit have your back okay um, the Buffalo spirit is also here the abundant universe will provide for you Sagis listen there is something between you Sagis and you and the Capricorns because if you have Capricorn Sun moon horizon sign and everyone has Capricorn Sun moon horizon sign go back and cross watch to see what comes up if these two um, energies come up for the Capricorns because I know it came up for someone these two just alike the Buffalo spirit is here to help you Sagittarius in the month of January the abundant universe will provide for you Sagittarius I gotta go for the people who wants to check out the rest of the reading we are going to start the Andaman namaste happy new year Okay, Sagittarius, you on the...